Good morning, everyone. Um, while I was working out this morning, um, this passage really spoke to me, and uh, I think um, a lot of you need to hear this word today and to encourage you. Um, it goes back in the Old Testament, in Exodus 14, 14, and let's just um, bring you up to speed on what's going on here. Um, the Israelites were in no position to fight with the Egyptian army, um, and there was really no escape. Um, with the Egyptians on one side and the Red Sea on the other, the Israelites were trapped in what seemed to be an impossible situation. Um, I think we've all been there before, right? Um, in a situation where, you know, our circumstances look impossible and doesn't look like there's no way out, and um, and we fret, we worry, we, you know, we have anxiety, we fear. Um, but I want to encourage you to do today is what Moses reminded the Israelites in Exodus 14, 14. And he says, hold your peace, remain at rest, and I will fight your battles. Wow. Um, this is such a powerful passage for all of us when we are you know, going through times like this. And it um, looks like it's impossible. But notice there was a condition, something the Israelites had to do. And it's the same thing with us today. God says, hold your peace. Remain at rest. That indicates to me something is trying to take that away, your peace away, your rest away. And like I said, um, that could be fear, worry, anxieties, a myriad of different things. Um, you might think, what if this doesn't happen? What am I going to do? We've all said those things in our mind and spoke them things out many times. But I'm here to encourage you again, if we just stay in peace, the creator of the universe, the most high God, will work on your behalf. Remember, remember this guys, as a follower, nothing can stand against our God. He has all the power. Whatever you face in life, if you will just hold your peace and remain at rest, God promises He will fight your battles for you and lead you to victory every time. Wow. I hope you guys um, really let this minister to you today and hope it speaks to your heart and encourages you to remain in peace and rest and trust God to take you through whatever you're dealing with. Well, I hope you have an amazing day. Um, know that I'm praying for you and love you guys.